one, Lucamus Prime here. So it is time for the weekly merchandise vlog of what I got this week and also what I've also unboxed. So in terms of unboxing first, this week I was able to build the Spider-Man No Way Home Final Battle set, which was a lot of fun to build. I definitely really build in that set. And I plan to build it as expansion afterwards, which I'm looking forward to doing. In terms of actual figure unboxings, this week I was able to unbox my figure of Black Widow, based on her appearance in Captain America Winter Sword. Definitely a really awesome figure. Then I also unboxed a Transformer, of course being Bumblebee from Rise of Beasts. This one was definitely lots of fun to unbox, unbox absolutely because I love Transformers. Then also as well, I unboxed my figure of War Machine, as he appears in Captain America Civil War. Definitely another really cool figure, absolutely. Then... This is because I always get quite a lot of video games on, on P PS3 mostly, and one PS2 game. So, in terms of uh, PS3 games, a vast majority of, of the games this week were actually the games based on my favourite spy character of all time, James Bond. So, and these are actually four of the games out of the six PS3 games that I got this week. So, for starters, for, I first of all got 007 Bloodstone, which is definitely one I've been really keen to get. It looks like it's going to be lots of fun. Because I've already played some James Bond games before, they're pretty awesome. Another one I've also played before, and I'm going to replay on PS3, is Quantum of Solace, which is, in my opinion, better than a movie. The game, that is. The game, in my opinion, is better than a movie. Then also, one that I've been meaning to try out, which is 007 Legends. I've been keen to try this one out. It's based on several films from the franchise. I'm very keen to play this one. Then another one I've also played before, which I also decided to get again, which is... GoldenEye Reloaded, which is basically a reimagining of the film GoldenEye, but this time with Daniel Craig as James Bond and a Pierce Brosnan, so that's what it is, really. And then also, as well, the other two PS3 games that I got, which are not James Bond, one of them is an upgrade, and that, of course, is Call of Duty 3, which I already have on PS2, but I upgraded it to, PS, to its PS3 version. Um, Definitely, Call of Duty, Call of Duty used to be a good franchise, that is. And then, in terms of an, an, another game, which is original and not like an upgrade or anything like that, Deuce Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut. So, in my opinion, Deuce Ex is an underrated franchise, one that I played in my childhood. I've been really keen to go down memory lane and play in this game, so I've got on PS3 with Director's Cut, let's see what that's like. Then, the one PS2 game that I got is another game from my childhood, and this is a game in which you play as several monsters smashing everything up, and that game is Rampage Total Destruction. Yeah, I played this game when I was a kid, it was on the original xbox and i got on ps2 so i'm happy about that then in terms of the one film that i got this week this time it's another classic film and this one is also a really old film as well from 1942 a really old film that actually saw Jim hardy and fruits ventura and i think it's an absolute masterpiece and and, and also as a, as, as a fun fact guys this film also means white house in spanish and that film of course is the absolute masterpiece casablanca so yeah, I absolutely love this film, it's an absolute masterpiece. If you guys have not seen it, then please go watch it, it's absolutely phenomenal. Then, I was able to get two figures this week. Now, one of them is, is, is a Marvel Legends figure, based on a Marvel villain from the comics. And this figure, of course, is of none other than the Mad Titan himself, Thanos. So here he is, of course, based on the comics. This is from the Infinity Gauntlet comic, I think, based on, of course, that text there. So yeah, definitely been really keen to get a figure of Thanos, and I finally got one. And finally, the, the figure, figure, that other figure that I got is based on on a character from from a film that I, I loved when I was a little kid. And as a fun fact as well, guys, if you guys are, are fans of the Ted films, you'll be aware that Johnny is actually a fan of this of this franchise too. And he gets to meet the actual players of character as well in in the films, which is definitely pretty awesome. And and this figure, of course, is none other than dun 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 dun, dun Flash. Ah, indeed. Flash Gordon, a figure of Flash Gordon, which I'm so happy to I'll, I'll get a figure of. So, this is also a naked figure as well. And if I open up this door, there is a figure. And I must say, I'm very impressed with, with the detail on this figure in terms of the design. I think they did a really great job with it. So, definitely lots of fun unboxing this figure in the future. Can't wait to do that. <laughs> so, and and yes, guys, I love the film, absolutely. It's from my childhood. Amazing film, Flash Gordon is. My will probably post review for, for it one day. So, guys, that's my merchandise haul of what I got this week. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that. So, you know the drill, guys. Be sure to give this video a like. Also, be sure to put in the comments what you, what you guys uh, thought of the vlog. What was your favourite thing that I got this week? Also, be sure to join Team Prime by pressing subscribe and it will come in the future. And I'll see you all later.